Falcon Heavy is capable of actually taking a Dragon mission, taking people around the moon. The biggest challenge of, of getting to the launch pad um, has been that we had to completely redesign the center core. Um, so the, the load going through the center core is much greater than would normally go through a Falcon 9 rocket. SpaceX has been the crown jewel of private space exploration, leading humanity toward a future among the stars. Elon Musk's ambitious company has revolutionized rocket science, set unprecedented milestones, and captivated the imagination of millions. But recent revelations about the reliability and safety of SpaceX's booster engines have sent shockwaves through the aerospace industry. A series of reports from astronauts, engineers, and industry insiders have exposed potential flaws in SpaceX's most critical systems, raising questions about the company's future. Could these revelations signal the beginning of the end for SpaceX? At the heart of SpaceX's success is the Falcon series of rockets, particularly the Falcon 9 and the Falcon Heavy. These rockets rely on the company's signature Merlin engines, designed to provide optimal performance and reusability. The ability to recover and reuse booster engines has allowed SpaceX to reduce costs dramatically, giving them a significant competitive edge over traditional aerospace companies and even national space agencies like NASA. The reusability of these booster engines is more than a technical achievement. It's the foundation of SpaceX's entire business model. Without the capacity to land and reuse these engines, the cost per launch would skyrocket, making many of SpaceX's ambitious projects financially unfeasible. However, the very feature that sets SpaceX apart is now under scrutiny. Recently, astronauts who have flown on SpaceX missions have started to raise concerns about the integrity of these booster engines. While their performance has been praised for many years, insiders suggest that the wear and tear on reused engines may be more severe than previously acknowledged. This could have catastrophic consequences, not just for individual missions, but for the future of SpaceX itself. Astronauts and engineers have reportedly highlighted inconsistencies in engine performance during pre-launch testing and actual missions. Issues such as unexpected vibrations, engine throttling anomalies, and unexplained wear on critical components have been flagged. While SpaceX has an extensive process for engine refurbishment and testing, some argue that the company's rapid launch schedule has put undue strain on quality assurance measures. In interviews and private discussions, astronauts have admitted feeling uneasy during missions due to these engine concerns. One astronaut reportedly said, you trust the system, but in the back of your mind, you know that every reused engine carries its own history, its own unknowns. Another commented that while SpaceX's engineering teams are among the best in the world, the drive to push boundaries sometimes comes at the expense of caution. Compounding these concerns is a report by independent aerospace analysts who examined the long-term viability of SpaceX's booster reusability program. Their findings indicate that after a certain number of launches, the costs of refurbishing a booster engine may outweigh the savings from reusability. Even more troubling, they suggest that repeated use could increase the likelihood of catastrophic failure, particularly during crewed missions. The ramifications of these findings extend beyond SpaceX's technical operations. The company has built its reputation on the promise of making spaceflight affordable and routine. Any indication that their reusable boosters are less reliable than advertised could undermine investor confidence, jeopardizing funding for future projects like Starship and the Mars Colonization Program. But how did we get to this point? To understand the current predicament, we must examine SpaceX's rapid rise and the pressures that come with being a pioneer. From the beginning, Elon Musk envisioned SpaceX as a disruptor in the space industry. His goal was to challenge the status quo, proving that private companies could achieve what had long been the domain of government agencies. This bold vision drove SpaceX to take risks, innovate quickly, and push the boundaries of what was considered possible. However, this same ambition has also led to a culture of relentless pace and high expectations. SpaceX's engineers are often tasked with solving problems on impossibly tight timelines and delays are seen as unacceptable. While this approach has yielded remarkable achievements, it has also created an environment where risks can be overlooked in the pursuit of progress. 
For years, SpaceX's strategy seemed to be paying off. The company achieved milestones that were once thought impossible. The first privately funded spacecraft to dock with the International Space Station, the first reusable orbital class rocket, and the first private crewed mission to orbit. Each success added to SpaceX's credibility and positioned the company as the leader in modern space exploration. But as the scale of SpaceX's ambitions has grown, so too have the challenges. The Starship program, intended to serve as the backbone for Mars colonization, has faced repeated delays and technical hurdles. The rapid pace of innovation required to develop such a revolutionary spacecraft has strained resources and diverted attention from other areas, including the maintenance and improvement of the Falcon series. The revelation about booster engine flaws could not have come at a worse time. SpaceX is currently juggling multiple high-stakes projects, including the expansion of its Starlink satellite network, the development of lunar landers for NASA's Artemis program, and preparations for its first Mars missions. Any disruption to the Falcon program could cascade through these initiatives, creating delays and financial strain. One of the most pressing concerns is the impact on crewed missions. SpaceX's crewed Dragon spacecraft, which relies on the Falcon 9 for launch, has become a cornerstone of NASA's human spaceflight program. If doubts about booster reliability persist, NASA may reconsider its reliance on SpaceX, opting instead to use other providers like Boeing's Starliner or even international partners. The potential loss of NASA contracts would be a devastating blow to SpaceX. Government contracts provide a stable source of revenue and serve as a seal of approval for private companies. Losing NASA's trust could make it more difficult for SpaceX to secure partnerships with other organizations, from commercial satellite operators to international space agencies. Investor confidence is another critical factor. SpaceX's valuation has soared in recent years, driven by its ambitious projects and impressive track record. But much of this valuation is based on future potential rather than current profitability. If the company's ability to deliver on its promises is called into question, it could trigger a financial crisis. Already, there are signs of unease among investors. Some have expressed concerns about the cost overruns and delays associated with the Starship program, while others worry about the sustainability of SpaceX's business model. The recent revelations about booster engines add another layer of uncertainty, making it harder for investors to justify their continued support. Elon Musk himself has acknowledged the challenges facing SpaceX. In a series of candid statements, he admitted that the company's ambitious goals come with significant risks. He has also emphasized the importance of learning from failures, viewing setbacks as opportunities to improve. However, critics argue that this approach may not be enough to address the underlying issues. One possible solution is for SpaceX to slow down and focus on quality over quantity. By taking the time to thoroughly test and refine its booster engines, the company could restore confidence in its technology. However, this would require a shift in the company's culture and priorities, a difficult task for an organization built on speed and innovation. Another option is to develop a new generation of engines specifically designed for reuse. While this would be a costly and time-consuming endeavor, it could provide a long-term solution to the current challenges. Such a project would likely involve significant investment in research and development, as well as collaboration with external experts. In the meantime, SpaceX must address the immediate concerns of its astronauts and partners. Transparent communication will be key to rebuilding trust. The company should provide detailed explanations of the issues, outline its plans for addressing them, and offer regular updates on its progress. Ultimately, the future of SpaceX will depend on its ability to adapt and overcome these challenges. The company has already achieved so much, proving that private industry can play a leading role in space exploration. But the road ahead will not be easy. If SpaceX can address the concerns about its booster engines, it may emerge stronger than ever, setting the stage for even greater achievements. However, if the company fails to act decisively, it risks losing its position as the leader in space exploration. The stakes could not be higher, not just for SpaceX, but for humanity's future in space.
As we stand on the brink of a new era in space exploration, the choices made today will shape the possibilities of tomorrow. Elon Musk and his team at SpaceX have shown us what's possible when ambition and innovation collide. Now they must show us what it takes to weather the storm and rise to even greater heights. The spotlight is shining brightly on SpaceX, and it's clear that the entire world is watching. SpaceX is not just a company, it's a movement, a symbol of humanity's aspirations to break free from Earth's boundaries. But the newly surfaced issues surrounding its booster engines have sparked a broader conversation about the fragility of even the most cutting-edge technology. The path forward demands not only technical solutions, but a re-evaluation of priorities, processes, and the pace at which space exploration is pursued. One of the critical aspects to consider is how SpaceX will handle the blow to its reputation. Public perception has played an enormous role in SpaceX's success. By making rocket launches look routine and bringing them into the public consciousness through live-streamed events, SpaceX has transformed the way we view space exploration. The spectacle of boosters landing vertically on drone ships is awe-inspiring, and it's this visual storytelling that has helped the company build trust among investors, partners, and the general public. Now with these revelations, the question is whether SpaceX can continue to maintain this level of trust. Transparency will be crucial. SpaceX has to navigate a fine line. They must admit faults and explain how they'll address them without fueling further doubt. This requires a level of corporate candor that few organizations can successfully pull off. If SpaceX overcorrects and admits too much, they risk alarming stakeholders. If they underplay the issue, they risk being seen as dismissive of safety concerns. Elon Musk's leadership style will undoubtedly come into play. Musk is known for his ability to galvanize his teams and turn monumental challenges into rallying cries. In the past, his statements have been instrumental in shifting narratives. However, this time, the stakes are higher. His words will need to be backed by action. Tangible, measurable changes that demonstrate SpaceX's commitment to safety and quality. One area where SpaceX has always excelled is innovation. The company has never been afraid to iterate, to fail fast and learn from those failures. In many ways, this crisis could serve as a catalyst for the next phase of SpaceX's evolution. Engineers and designers may now have the opportunity to revisit the foundational assumptions behind booster reuse. Could there be a way to redesign the Merlin engines to make them more robust? Could advancements in materials science offer solutions to the wear and tear problems? The answers to these questions will require time and resources, two commodities that SpaceX has always tried to stretch. But in this case, there may be no shortcuts. The aerospace industry is one where even the smallest oversight can lead to catastrophic consequences. Unlike software development, where bugs can be patched, aerospace engineering demands perfection from the start. Another layer of complexity comes from SpaceX's contractual obligations. The company has signed deals with NASA, private corporations, and even international governments. Each of these contracts comes with specific expectations and deadlines. Delays caused by booster engine redesigns could lead to financial penalties and strained relationships. On the other hand, continuing to launch with potentially flawed technology risks far greater consequences. The tension between maintaining a rapid launch schedule and ensuring absolute safety will be a defining challenge for SpaceX. It's a challenge that mirrors broader debates about the role of private companies in space exploration. Unlike government agencies, which are funded by taxpayers and operate with different accountability structures, private companies must balance innovation with profitability. SpaceX's ability to navigate this balance will set a precedent for other players in the industry. The revelations about booster engine issues have also reignited discussions about the broader safety culture at SpaceX. Some critics have pointed to the company's famously demanding work environment, suggesting that the pressure to meet ambitious goals may inadvertently lead to lapses in judgment. While SpaceX's high-pressure environment has driven incredible achievements, it may also be time for a cultural shift, one that prioritizes long-term reliability over short-term milestones. 
This cultural shift would need to start at the top. Elon Musk's vision has always been the driving force behind SpaceX's meteoric rise. But as the company grows, its leadership structure will need to evolve. Delegating more responsibilities to experienced aerospace professionals and fostering a culture of open communication could help SpaceX avoid future crises. Meanwhile, the aerospace community at large is closely watching how SpaceX addresses these issues. Competitors like Blue Origin, Boeing, and Rocket Lab are undoubtedly taking notes. While these companies respect SpaceX's accomplishments, they also see an opportunity to differentiate themselves by emphasizing reliability and safety. The lessons learned from SpaceX's challenges could influence the entire industry, shaping how reusable rockets are designed, tested, and operated. One potential avenue for collaboration is the sharing of best practices. While SpaceX has often operated in a competitive silo, this crisis could encourage greater cooperation among aerospace companies. By pooling knowledge and resources, the industry as a whole could advance more quickly and safely. For SpaceX, embracing a more collaborative approach could also help rebuild trust with partners and stakeholders. The role of government oversight is another factor to consider. Agencies like the Federal Aviation Administration FAA, and NASA already play a significant role in regulating spaceflight activities. In light of the recent revelations, these agencies may implement stricter guidelines for reusable rockets. While increased oversight could slow down SpaceX's operations, it might also provide an additional layer of assurance to astronauts, investors, and the public. The booster engine controversy has also sparked a broader conversation about the ethics of pushing the boundaries of technology. Space exploration is inherently risky, but where should we draw the line? At what point does the pursuit of innovation outweigh the potential risks to human life? These are questions that SpaceX and the entire aerospace community must grapple with as they look to the future. Looking ahead, the next few years will be critical for SpaceX. The company will need to demonstrate that it can learn from this crisis and emerge stronger. This will require not only technical fixes, but also a renewed commitment to transparency, safety, and collaboration. SpaceX's journey has always been about more than just rockets. It's about proving that humanity can overcome the impossible, that we can reach for the stars and succeed. This latest challenge is a reminder that even the most ambitious visions come with obstacles. But if any company can rise to the occasion, it's SpaceX. As we await SpaceX's next moves, one thing is clear. The future of space exploration depends on the lessons learned today. Whether it's redesigning booster engines, re-evaluating safety protocols, or fostering a culture of continuous improvement, the choices made now will shape the trajectory of humanity's journey to the stars. Elon Musk and SpaceX have shown us what's possible when ambition and innovation collide. Now they must show us what it takes to weather the storm and rise to even greater heights. The world is watching, and the stakes could not be higher. SpaceX's story has always been one of resilience, determination, and vision. This latest chapter is no different. It's a test of the company's ability to adapt, to learn, and to grow. And in the end, it's a test of humanity's collective will to push beyond our limits and reach for the stars. If SpaceX can overcome this challenge, it will not only secure its place as the leader in space exploration, but also inspire a new generation to dream big and aim high. And that, more than anything else, is the legacy that SpaceX has always sought to create. Will SpaceX rise to the challenge and prove its doubters wrong? Only time will tell. But one thing is certain, the journey to the stars is far from over and SpaceX will continue to play a leading role in shaping our future among the cosmos.